Hi, I am Prakash Sharati. In this video, you will learn extruded food processing technology. The main learning outcomes. What is been by extruded foods? Its principle of production process, applications and construction and working of the extrusion technology which is used in the food processing. Do you know how to prepare the Kurkure, puffed products, vermicidia. These are number of the products which are prepared by the extrusion technology in which puffing process or pasta processing, vermicidia noodles processing. These are the main products which is prepared by the food extrusion technology. Extruded foods that means the foods which are prepared from the food ingredients in which the cereal grain is a major ingredient which are extruded into the product in which the extrusion technology basic principle is that thermomechanical processing that means by application of heat transfer and mass transfer involving number of unit operations in which mixing, kneading, cooking, forming process and resulting we get the product which is then post processing may be drying or may be baking, roasting, enrobing, coating. These are the post processing treatment is carried out and resulting we get the number of products into the different shape size as per our requirement. In the food extrusion processing technology. The main raw materials used for the production of the different extruded food products in which the main basically raw materials based on the cereal grain with added maybe pulses, oil seeds, potatoes are the main raw materials which are coarsely milled and used for the production of the different extruded food products preparation along with the addition of the number of the additives in which basically these raw material are first milled into the coarse milling or maybe sometime used as a directly for the extruded products like the puffed product preparations in which this raw material are converted into the final product by using the extrusion technology in which product is passed through the by providing the dyes as per our requirement they can convert it to the different products the main product involving that is the first one is the vermicidia in snacks, pasta processing, then spaghetti. These are the number of the products which are prepared in different shape and the size by the extrusion technology. The raw material used for the processing of the extruded food processing in which the main raw material that is the first one is the structural forming raw material in which cereal grains and the potato main which is forming of the final structure of the product. Then fillers in which the oil seeds, legumes and the some of the cereals which are added which are the protein base to in order to control the puffing of the final product. Then plasticizing ingredients in which the water, oil, fat, emulsifying agents which is help to formation of the dough and facility to for the uh, smoothing of the final product. Then hydrocolloids material in which the thickening, stabilizing and the gelling agents. These are the additives also added for the specific improving the physical property of the final product. Emulsifying agents are added on the basis of the fat dissolving uh, that is the fat based emulsifying agents to facility smoothening for the shearing ability. Then rising agents that means the leavening agents in which the baking powder is mostly used. As a leavening agent for a specific baked uh, product which are uh, extruded. Then taste improving agents in which the sugar, salt and the spices which are added in order to improve the taste of the final product. These are the main ingredients, examples and the role of the ingredients in the extruded food processing. The main parts of the extrusion machine in which the Main parts involving first that is the extruder screw which is fitted at the center of the barrel. This is the single screw extrusion in which internal of that barrel centrally mounted screw 
there should be the provision of the provided with the bearing systems then provided with the pulley and connected with the power transmission devices the barrel externally fitted with the steam jacketed kettles in which the heating and cooling system heating and cooling system is carried out by circulating the steam through the external jackets then there should be the provision of the feeding of the raw material from the hopper into the this extrusion machines the feeding of the raw material is carried out by using the screw conveyor systems or the vibrating uh, input system in which the intermediate addition of the liquid ingredients like the water or maybe addition of the steam or addition of the oil substances or addition of the flavoring substances the main screw which is divided into the sections in which the conveying section mixing section cooking section and the high pressure shearing section and finally forming section there should be the provision of the die which is uh, changed as per our requirement and finally the rotating knife that is the cutting mechanism after the extrusion of the product which is cut into the different uh, size as per our requirement these are the main parts involving in the extrusion machines in the extrusion machines the extrusion machines are specifically sections or also called as a zone in which the feeding zone kneading zone cooking zone and the forming these are the basic zones in the extrusion processing technology the materials which are first pre conditioning is carried out or maybe pre conditioning which is the provided in the extrusion machine also the materials are dried materials are loaded by providing the feeding system by using the screw conveyors or by using the vibrating devices in which the materials are continuously uniformly with constant rate feeded into the extrusion machines after the feeding of that material the first the materials are first pre conditioning is carried out into the feeding sections first they are pre conditioning with the addition of the steam and water and other whatever the liquid ingredients and after that mixing pre mixing and the final mixing in which the final mixing kneading is carried out in which the press slightly pressure is increased and the formation of the dough which which also increasing the slightly temperature and the pressure in the mixing zone after that the next one is the cooking zone there should be the provision of the external jacket to circulate the steam or some uh, extruder provided with the electrical heater systems in cooking zone the gelatination of the starch is carried out and after that the cooking addition of the flavoring and the coloring matters in liquid form then next one is the high pressure shearing force and last one is the forming zone forming zone in which the uh, compressed and pass the whatever the dough which is prepared into the specific provided with the die and finally cutting is uh, occurred these are the main zones involving in the extrusion machines in the thermo mechanism process in the extrusion process involving mixing kneading cooking sterilization then metering and the texturing popping forming these are the various unit operations which are involving in a single extrusion machine the extrusion machine screw may be either a single piece or may be into the multi piece screw system single piece in which the mostly in tapered shape uh, which is used for in cold extrusion process and in multi piece system there should be the, they are divided to the sections and mostly is for the hot extrusion process the main parts of the the screw is first one is the screw root that means the root that is the screw shaft is called as a screw root that means the total shaft of that a screw is called as a root mostly in a conical shape that is the tapered in shape and specifically on the top of that root provided with the flights the screw flights that mean the screw threading is called as a flights then pitch that means the distance between the flights nearest 
flight distance is called as a pitch and flight depth that means the this is the width of the flight and the this is the depth of the flight the basic types of the extrusion system in which the on the basis of the method of operations cold extrusion hot extrusion system and the, on the basis of their internal provided single screw extruder or may be provided with the twin screw extruders different type of the extrusion systems in which basically these are the number of the systems in which the specific designs in which variation of the root diameter with respect to the length of that extrusion machines or change of the diameter of the barrels with respect to the length of the extruders then variable pitch with respect to the length of the extruders then constant pitch constant root and the constant diameter of the extruders in which internally provided bolts in which the bolts which produce the more shearing force then in which the pitch distance is variable with the constant or diameter of that extruders in this way number of the designs are available for the extrusion processing the basic difference between the cold extrusion and the hot extrusion technology is that cold extrusion that means food is heated or uh, which is the extruded below 100 degrees celsius temperature and the hot extrusion system internal temperature is more than 100 degrees celsius in the cold extrusion technology mostly production of the pasta related product noodle related products which are the prepared and the hot extrusion processing in which the puffing products are or the ready to eat product or the snacks which are the prepared by the hot extrusion technology the single screw extruder and the twin screw extruders as per our requirement internal shearing force or the specific type of the ingredients and the final product requirement we can use the single screw extruder or by using twin screw extruder mostly single screw extruder used for the production of the pasta and uh, noodle related products and the twin screw extruder used for the more shearing force in which the maybe operated co current and counter current rotating extruders in which produce the more shearing force as compared to single screw extruders and prepared the different type of the extruded food products the main steps involving in the processing technology in the extruded food products at the first is the mixing tank in which the dry ingredients are first properly mixed up whatever the cereal grain grits the different type of the cereal grain grits with added with the whatever the dry ingredients these are the properly first mixed then feed into the pre conditioning system by providing with the screw conveyor feeding systems then the pre conditioning systems addition of the waters or maybe addition of the steam injection or addition of the oils and other uh, nutrients or maybe added with the uh, additive substances in this pre conditioning system pre mix after that pre mix which is the loaded with the screw conveyor system into the continuous extrusion machines in this extrusion machines system to produce the extruded food product after that the cutting is carried out and finally they may be dried fried or may be coated and finally they are packed these are the main steps involving in the processing of the extruded food product preparation the production process of the ready to cook products in which the noodles vermicelli or pasta product these are the products which is prepared by the extrusion technology the vermicelli um, making machines which is operated by the uh, electrical motor this is the hand operated vermicelli machines or maybe number of the machines are available in which the pasta and noodles are automatically we can prepared by only simply we can change the dye as per our requirement we can convert the raw material into the different shape size of the noodles vermicelli and the pasta product in which the main steps involving first uh, ingredients in which the semolina the semolina mostly used for the durum wheats durum wheats with added with the some of the additives and added with the moisture that is the water is added to increase the moisture percentage up to 20% 
then first they are preconditioning with addition of the water then are properly mixing for the 10 to 50 minutes then processed into the single screw extruders to to formation of the shape as per the noodles for miscellaneous pasta products and finally they are dried to reduce the moisture content up to 3 to 4 percent and they packed and distributed the production process of the ready to eat foods by the extrusion system changes the number of the products which are the prepared in which the first direct expanded snacks that is the puffer product then bread snacks filled snacks multigrain chips crispy flat bread crunchy cereals fried collides in which the number of this product they are puffer products maybe with the enrobing or maybe internally filled product flat products may be baked products this type of the number of the products which are prepared by the extrusion technology in this first the ingredients in which the cereal grain grits added with the additives then directly extrusion process with the addition of the other liquid ingredients then frying process then finally after the frying process coating with the spices salt sugar and uh, other flavoring and the seasoning uh, specific additives or maybe added with the natural ingredients or the flavoring substances and finally packaging of the product these are the references used for this preparation of this powerpoint presentation in this video discussion you learn what is meant by extrusion technology its production process steps extrusion machines parts and specific application in the food processing thank you very much